Now, last week in the Oval Office, President Trump reportedly said the most vulgar and racist things I've ever heard a president of either party utter. In fact, I've never heard any president, Republican or Democrat, utter anything even similar. Now he denies using the specific word. And there's been some, maybe he used a different word, maybe he didn't. Now, Madam Secretary, you were in the room. You're under oath. Did President Trump use this word or a substantially similar word to describe certain countries? I did not hear that word used, no, sir. I'm not, that's not a question. Did he use anything similar to that describing certain countries? The conversation was very impassioned. I don't uh, dispute that the president was using tough language. Others in the room were also using tough language. Was the con he? If I could, the concept and the context, I believe, in which uh, this came up was the concept that the president would like to move to a merit-based system. He would like to not and no longer look at quotas and, and from uh, countries. Did he use what would be considered vulgar language referring to certain countries? Uh, the president used tough language in general, as did other uh, congressmen in the room. Yes, sir. Yes, uh, the others aren't. Uh, president, uh, you, you imply the president was articulating support for a merit-based immigration system like those in Australia or Canada. Uh, but when he denigrated Haiti, El Salvador, and Africa, a country where uh, we are trying to have some uh, ability to, to match China and others in influence, he didn't say it's because we needed more PhD students or skilled workers. He said he wanted more people from Norway. Being from Norway is not a skill. And with the standard of living in Norway better than ours, you're not going to have too many people from there. What does he mean when he says he wants more immigrants from Norway? I don't believe he said that specifically. What he was saying was he was using Norway as an example of a country that is uh, what he was specifically referring to is the prime minister telling him that the people of Norway work very hard. Uh, and so what he was referencing is, from a merit-based perspective, we'd like to have those with skills who can assimilate and contribute to the United States, moving away from country quotas and to an individual merit-based system. Norway is a predominantly white country, isn't it? I'm, I, I actually do not know that, sir, but I imagine that is the case. Okay. 